Susan. Have I ever mentioned her name? She did Chris. What's her real name? I beg, my sister, I beg. Uh, 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 my sister, you go see her when I post them. You go see the name when I post them. Don't be, don't be. Wait for me that one now. Uh, I beg, don't let anybody beg you. Everybody, they, they tell place. me, say, make I keep quiet, make I they, keep quiet. Which kind of thing be that? She take quite many minutes, say, they talk about me. What's that thing that you want to do? She's calling me Catherine, Catherine. Oh, I don't hide my name. My name is Ring Whisper. You know, they see the ring. Don't do that with, don't do that with, with the No, let's be realistic. This lady went on live. They lie about me. Lies. I she have no integrity. Not even a single integrity. And I've been keeping quiet. Is she crazy? Is she crazy? Is Susan crazy? Uh, <laughs> can I answer that? Yes, yeah, she is crazy. Am I, am I allowed to talk? Go ahead, mommy. Sorry. Good morning, good afternoon, wherever you may be, the panelists and the commenters. Uh, thank you, everybody, for all you do. I want to talk on uh, mommy Mubad. Mommy Mubad, she's a pathological liar. And the way she talks in the public, it's amused me how a 50-year-old woman will be lying effortlessly. And she knows deep down in her that she's lying. The first VN uh, Honorable York played in the morning, that was what I'm referring to. That they know deep down that they are the right people. They don't know what happened to Mubad, so, 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 and so, so, so. That as it, as it may be. I want to talk about the super mom. Immediately the super mom was brought in, I knew it's great. she's going to talk negatively. Because all the time I'm scrolling on this page of TikTok, I always meet her on either Aries, Paparino, or the negative people. Personally, I don't know what they want to gain in what they are doing. We all clamored for this uh, autopsy and toxicology approval and eventually we were given the approval which I believe everybody should be happy about we should even share our differences and by now come together to know the way forward but instead they started forming another uh, another I mean what can I put it another scenario they started gangrene up again antagonizing Please, are these people anti-justice in disguise or justice for Mubad in disguise? What do they really want? Because I don't understand. This heiress of a woman, what did she really want to get? What is she looking for in justice for Mubad? What is Papa Rino? What does he want to get from justice for Mubad? He will go to the other side today. He will support justice for, uh, for Mubad today. Tomorrow he will support me. Why are we all doing this? Honestly, I'm so disheartened with the things that are going. By now, we should be talking on the financial support of Baba Mubad. All the justice movement. I know the way forward, the contribution, so that she should be able to go and do the toxicology and uh, what is it called? Autopsy immediately. Please, they are distractions. Because they are stupid. They are human beings in animal form. We don't have to listen to them. Although as human beings it pains. But please, don't let us just listen to them. Just let's neglect them and know that they are distractors. They are all animals. The paparino said, the iris, the soul, something for life. They are all animals. I know they are all looking for what they want to gain. In justice for mobile. And that is very wrong of them. So please... I want to implore all of us to please let us look for ways on how to donate endlessly into this GoFundMe and Access Bank so that we can go forward. Then the only thing we pray for is that our legal team should not be bought by anyone. They should squarely be truthful, do what they are going to do. And I know by God's grace, we are going to be victorious. Thank you, Justin, for mobile. Thank you. Thank you, Mama Imola. Can I speak next, please, your daddy? Please go ahead. And uh, please, uh, with all this, when I leave Paparano, Paparano is my paddy. When I leave him, I beg. When I leave him. 
Uh, it's okay. It's okay. You know. Go on, go on. Um, go on. I actually, um, yeah. Look, I, I think Ryan whispers. I think many people know who you are. You're a genuine person. You truly care about justice for my bad. Well, for as long as I can only speak for myself. So no one can ever change my mind in regards to who you are. Um, and I don't think many people's mind will be changed on in, in regards to that just because of one person's agenda or narrative. Um, it's very clear, as we all know, that there are a certain group of people who are who wanted to take charge of this justice um, because they thought that they could do a better job. And because they haven't had their way, they they thrive on being negative in hopes that they will eventually be brought on board and be given first-hand information in order to set their agendas or to say that they're the driving force of, of what's happening. It's, it's very obvious. And I think that um, many of us, me included, I think when I started to notice those things, I sort of moved away from some of those spaces and started to come to safer places where I know there are genuine people that are looking for justice, like York Daddy, um, the Ish, Oleda, where we can have actual conversations um, that are meaningful and, and, and helpful to Baba rather than sit there and uh, have a go at him. There are people that I've always been skeptical of, and I'm not afraid to actually say their name on here, and I always try and be diplomatic, but I have to be honest. When it comes to, with Lady Aris, I, I, I'm not going to lie to you, I, I like her, I think she has her own grudges and her, you know, her own problems, fine, but when it comes to Susie, specifically, and I don't know if you're in here, Susie, but I have to say, we were told that you work for the American government, and I have never known anybody that works for an American government that is on TikTok 24-7. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> you know, go on, go on, go on. Sorry? Uh, I, I have... have... The bullets, bullets. You just shot a bullet, sorry. No, it's true. You know, I... I and... She is a beggar. She's a beggar on the streets. She doesn't have... A... <laughs> you know, we all have jobs here. As I'm very open. I work nights. Um, so I have all the time in the world to be on TikTok during the day um, when my kids are in school, my husband's not here, I've got the house to myself, I can speak to you guys anytime. I use this as a radio when I'm doing my reports. So I, I, I have all the time in the world. But when you introduce yourself as someone of importance to the rest of us and make us all feel as though we're nothing, which is fine, you know, and then you say, I work for the American government, I can get justice for you. But then you're always on TikTok and half of the things that you say do not make sense. I think, <laughs> I think that... Uh, you, it, my, my darling, my British sister, hold on. You see, York, this is what you call British Oibo bashing. Now, I will put it down. You, no. Susie, I break it down for you. Let me tell you something. <laughs> this is what we call British Oibo bashing. Carry on, my sister. <laughs> I think, you know, I've always avoided having a direct conversation with Susie because I was always afraid that I would say something that would offend her. But in all honesty, even if she was up here, I would, I would, I would directly tell her that I just don't think that I would have any sort of confidence if she was in charge of anything, even in justice for Mobad. So I'm so glad that um, whoever made their judgment that she wasn't the right person to be in charge, uh, I think they have great judgment um, in, in knowing that she's not some, someone who's supposed to drive anything uh, or, or, or on, on anything or manage anything. She's all over the place. Um, she's, I know we've, I'm very emotional, but I think that Susie, you know, flip flops a lot. She called Bereket and was telling Bereket what to do, an entire institution, something that I would never do myself. So I just found with some of her actions that she is not a responsible individual. So Ryan whispers, worry not, 
many of us thank take you so whatever. much no thank honestly you, thank many you. of us take what she says with a grain of salt i think many of the things that she said goes over many people's heads uh i i used to i now just take it as if maybe she's not being serious she's actually saying it as a joke so i wouldn't take what she says to heart or even give her the and no offense susie the time of day to go back and forth. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's just my opinion. <laughs> I, I will count it as she's looking for frame, my sister. She's looking for frame. Maybe. And I, hope, and I hope she finds it. And I hope she finds it. It's just not going to be amongst us because I think that there are too many intelligent people that uh, that are on this justice and that are the driving force to find injustice. And unfortunately, she's not one of them. So thank you, Susie, but no thank you. And no worry, Ryan Whispers, we've got your back. Thank you so much. Continue doing what you're doing. And boss man, worry not. Don't waste your time. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Thank you so much, my darling sister on Vegetable. Thank you. I'm very grateful. I'm glad you came out today and I'm glad you were able to say the things that you said. I was just bawling when I saw Anna Suko dancing and just giving us all of that behind the camera. You know, it is what it is. You know, I, you know, you're so intelligent and, and you have very intelligent women here, Toyin, uh, Anna Suko. You have intelligent people here to, to waste my time. The thing that I'm going to waste my time talking about Susan is such it's such a pain right now, okay? I, I see this as advertisement. I was just told by Lagata that, um, you know, she started her live and all of that. Um, this is cheap adver advertisement for her. So it is what it is. But Susan, <laughs> Susan, watch me. Watch me. I'm coming for you. I want to see you come. Okay. And I'm still Pastor watching. Auntie Ryan, see, Miss Pahoda, let me speak my language. See, Su uh, Susan, I would not you know, cow, 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 so good man, fien. <laughs> I'm gonna try right with that. Oh, that's 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 Thank you so much, Anna Suko. God will bless you. Thank you so much. I'll try and understand what you said. I'm going to call, call you behind closed doors. I really need to understand. God will bless you for what you've said. Um, Susan, you got that right. Keep trying. Keep trying. We have women here waiting for you. Keep keep going, Susan. I challenge you. Come up here. Come up. There's space for you to come up here. If you're truly the woman uh, that you claim to be that you are, come up here. Come up here. My, with your my own eyes is on, uh, on other up. platform. My eyes is on, uh, on another platform where they used to go and abuse Baba Mubad. My eyes is on. I will shake out. If I see her there. Yeah, 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 Come and say it to my face. You don't go to a platform and call when people are sleeping, when women bees are sleeping. You know, you don't come out at that. <laughs> you come down the day, day If she's not coming, boss man, if, if she's, she's not, not coming here. Yeah. She will not come. Mama love you. Like I'm telling you. Because she's a cat. Because she's a cat. man. She's not going to come. If she's life. Cat. If they are life, eh? Me, I will DM you. I will share to if you. you are Let's alive, go, Jay. Let's go and meet them. Request. I will come to your life. Don't block Let's me. Let's go and meet them. Susan is a cat. Let's go and meet them. What was you said? You should say I for an eye, name. If they don't want peace, we will not give them peace. If they want peace, we will give them peace. And sister, I told you there's part two of this. I swear to my papa. We are going there. Eris, so. if you come live, we are coming. We are coming. Expect us. Bunch of <laughs> <laughs> Please, please, please. Let's, let's, not, let's Sorry, go. aluminium condemn. Her name is uh, Victoria. Aries Co. Aries Me. Her name is Victoria. I've been telling Bosma, I don't want to drag because I don't want trouble. I don't like problems. But at this point, it is what it is. Woto, woto, we go give her. I sabi oh. I just ah, you down. guys should calm yes. down. Yes. Calm down. Uh, uh, we'll we'll My brother will not calm down we'll for we'll this we'll matter. We'll 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 we know we're fine. We're fine. I've been I've been waiting for Lady Man to do what what all these days. No, no, now, nah, nah, boss I'm man. No. Now, nah, Susie has mentioned her name. Susie has mentioned her name. Leave Lady Man alone for that. Give this food that will be like a rat where escape from inside water. Are you are you kidding me? I know they even listen to her with the old woman voice. 
I don't know you. Yeah, you don't yeah, know you, me. Yeah, like a young eh? new way. That's I don't know voice. this lady. She don't know me. He didn't tell me say I'll be friends to Yabo Ojo. I don't understand. Yabo Ojo, I get the time where I invited Yabo Ojo to come my house. Hey, eh, Susan, where you, you just sit down, they, they, they sit down, they lie, they give people. Character assassination. No, think about it. Which kind of woman you be? And you think people gonna listen to you, to your lies? You they crazy, eh? Something they worry you. You just jump the wrong, wrong tree. You just climb the wrong tree to have mentioned my name. Everything where I get to even do for Baba Mobad, if you really get love for this Baba Mobad, where you they fight for, you supposed to come talk I'm outside, saying I wait I want to do for Baba Mobad. Are you supposed to talk about it outside in the public? Useless thing. I beg no verse with my brother. I listen at your platform, honorable York daddy. I don't know how to pass come. That's why I just keep quiet. Because when you see them, my mind I go down. She's a useless woman. Very useless thing. Nonsense. Ah, oh God. I hope, I hope, Susie, I hope you have this evidence of Yabo Joe visiting uh, Lady Ryan's house, Abby. Hope you have it. Uh, 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 boss man, I, I, you don't. I beg, Mona. I beg, I beg. Mo could just Mo forgive. Uh, what to be a name? So the thing, the, no, the thing. I say, beg, no vex. I will just come up for your quiet all this time. Okay. See, we've been keeping oh, quiet all this while. I've never mentioned their names and on on all, all forms. And if Baba Mobad blocks them, he has the reason why he blocks them. But you making Baba cry when he just lost his son. Uh, this me, Mister Me, we keep quiet. Boss man, I think to I sorry please, I need to understand that part. I don't understand. Making Baba cry as in. Okay, this is what happened, man. Huh? I didn't know this woman anyway. I've been talking on Facebook and I've been known by Baba before all these people came in here. I was on Yekudi. Yekudi has to ask me, boss man, there are some people calling. Should I add them to the call to the call? I said yes, add them to the call. I met them on Yekudi's platform. <laughs> and then we went in a group. And then uh, I guess I met all three of them at the same time. They they rang Susie Victoria. Don't eat there, boss man, because she said I came with you. <laughs> I bet listen to this voice. I beg. He's on your put everything is on no, your platform. Oh, we are the one you know making making decision for Papa Mobiles. And this lady in question is a very good friend of Iyabojo. So people that is listening to us tonight on the comment sessions and listening, how do you feel comfortable with based on Iyabojo's uh, uh, position in this justice for Mubad? Are you going to feel comfortable uh, to have Baba Mubad be close to somebody that is Iyabojo's friend? Can, can can you hear that? Can you hear that, uh, 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 honourable? That's that inciting. This inciting. Exactly. Oh, that's right. Exactly. That's right. Yeah, exactly. Are you people are telling me to be calm? That's How wrong. dare her? That is wrong. Um, are you people are telling me to be calm. The lady in question. <laughs> question. <laughs> question. The lady in question. <laughs> Eh? The lady in question. <laughs> yeah, with her, with her as no. sabam, uh, eh? Buka, the lady Buka in Bula question. Is Baba Mubad? Is a Iyabo Joe friend? The lady in question. Man, no go keep me today. Uh, please, no, no, no. Hello, daddy. Oh, she's calling me. Wait, whisper, just hold on. I want to hear that boss man. That that uh, they made Baba cry. Baba had to block them. Man, no. uh, let me just hear yes, more. Oh. So in the group, then uh, this woman was the one that came in, both of them and the cohorts, because the cohorts not mention my name on this record. I will not mention her name. All right, this woman with her cohort kept saying that uh, Baba Mobad Otuko Oje in his first account, Wema Bank accounts, with all the billions that they sent to him to his to their accounts. He will drop. I guess they paid he Baba Mobad hundred thousand naira or one fifty thousand. Baba Mobad will talk rubbish that Baba on the group page. We're like, 
stagnating, it's getting too much to the point that Mr. Mira couldn't take it anymore. They would, even on Yekudi's life, they dragged Baba Muba that they, they, they drag, I can play it, I can go, it, like that you have that recording now of them when they dragged Baba Muba on Yekudi. That was what made Yekudi to block these people on our platform. It's because Yekudi blocked this set of people, they came for Yekudi. And they believe that I am the one that is make that make Baba Mobile to block them. Mr. Miwa talked that how could you guys be dragging his brother in a group? And they decided to leave. So how is that my own problem? You would abuse this man to the point that this man would as if he's a, he's a puppet. Because you gave him 100,000 naira or 150,000 naira. Come here, Baba Mobad. Mope yo, bad go. How can you? I would. How dare you talk to Baba Mobad like that? Call out your bank account, make you pay that money back to you. If you don't bring that money, you are a bastard. Bring that money out, make it return your money back to you, and leave that man alone for free. Is it crazy? The man left. Mr. Mima couldn't take it anymore. This same set of people, when they came out with the Ada Foundation. They came to us and in a group and they said that at that, that foundation is a is only that he went to um start a, a GoFundMe without Baba Mobile consent. That after they all created the group together, then Ada was not answering them anymore. They have came back, they abused at that foundation. They call her a thief on the, on the group. And they, that's why I stopped they, calling for Ada. That's why I stopped calling Ada. Exactly. And I'm going to call Ada this evening. That was the reason I stopped. Oh, we bring you, Ada you here. Said, See, they said Ada, Ada, Ada don't Ada kick them out, Lady Ryan. Ada don't kick them out. The same thing they did, they don't, don't do out to Ada. Ada to Are you Ada kidding me? Ada to don't kick them out of the foundation right now. <laughs> Ada don't kick them out of that foundation. Ada too want to talk. Bring Ada to this platform. She can't talk okay. her own. Waiting they do for Ada. Okay. This time around, I don't ever hear this part where the thing, the thing where these people they talk behind her. They said that Ada goes. That please share to Ada, Ada Universe. Can you please share to her, please? Ada Universe go hear everything. You will hear everything. Yeah. Let's come down. Tony, here. Tony, Let's I go come. drop you. I go block you. Tony, I go block you. Take time. Uh, so, please continue. Okay. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I beg, I beg, can I talk before I go into this school? Let me, uh, let me even give you the story so that you guys will understand. Uh, uh, boss man, boss man, I'll just speak for two minutes, then you carry on the story, please. If, if, if that's okay. I, I want to go into and pick my kids from school. Young daddy, the reason why I came up is, um, sorry, I've just been busy, but I've been listening to the comment section. Reason why I came up is, you know, this, um, Susie woman. I don't know her from Adam. Uh, I only met her on TikTok. We have never interacted on any platform. And what Rai Whispers played, saying that she knows uh, Yabojo, and the lady is saying she doesn't know. Lies. Now, why am I saying that? This Susie woke up one night, like what boss man said. People are busy sleeping, and you guys will come live and be bashing somebody. You, I don't know you. I have never spoken about you. And I woke up in the morning, and people are saying that Susie is calling me fake Ghanaian. I was like, what? What did I do to this woman? You don't know me. You don't know my background. And you just open your mouth and call me a fake Ghanaian. Where do you know me from? And I just kept quiet because as it is, I don't like dragging. If you notice, I don't like dragging. So I don't expect anybody to drag me. I've never spoken about her. So I believe everything that she says from her mouth is lies. I've never said this on a platform. I've never dragged anybody. But for you calling me a fake Ghanaian, where do you know me from? Have you done a risk background check on me or what? I don't understand. So please, Susan, kindly take my name off your mouth. Thank you. Yes, thank you so much. I want to give you guys a little bit of story of what really happened. That, that generated to this point, or generated to this point, where when Mr. Miwa, all this set of people come from Mr. Miwa, and why they all gang up 
against Baba Mobad and Mr. Miwa. Okay? So that by the time I tell you all this, maybe you understand how all this thing generated. We met on Yekudi. Um, the last person to join that group was a Westo. I, um, some people said that, oh, we should, there is a guy on TikTok, blah, blah, blah. He's a very good, and I've been hearing Resto very well talking about Justice for Mobile. So I brought, um, I got Westo's number and I brought her in. This same two set of people, Lady Ranch, oh, she dropped. They, she, they refused Westo to join that group. Westo was on the probation for like, Four days until I later told Mr. Miwa that no, 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 no. Westo is trusted. He should join the group. Then he allowed to jump. So it's not up to like a, a week or two weeks that Westo joined that the whole thing messed up. So before in that group, Moses, myself, Lady Wine, um, Victoria, well, uh, Williams, that is Susan. And then um, other people that you guys don't know about um, three or four more people that you go to. There's a Jamaican woman there now. So in that group. So, um, but anytime you want to have a meeting, if you have a meeting for like four hours, just know that the three and the half hours is going to be Wotu Wotu. Because they believe that when they want to talk, they don't want to be, they don't want you to interrupt them. All right. And they want to, they believe their suggestion is the best. All right. They brought in the former lawyer. The former lawyer said he doesn't want to talk to anybody in that room. Why? Because of this set of people. Lady Wine, please, if I say something, if you think I'm wrong, you can correct me, please. Okay? All right? If we, um, even Moses himself, whenever they are talking like this, Moses always leave the group because they were to, were to the way they happen for this too much. All right? And the way they talk to Baba Mubad is so, oh my God. It's just too much. We very condescending. Condescending. Osman. Very condescending. Yeah. Baba so, Mobad is a thief. Baba Mobad is too, you know, very greedy. He wants these. I will send him money. The money he was given, um, you know, he won't use it. If you ask him to bring that money or bring something out, he will tell you he doesn't have one. It was too much. Too much. All right. Too so, much. Moving forward. This thing went on. And we've been having this, like, how come this woman just talked to this uh, about any hour and days and all that? All right. So one day they said that um, uh, Baba Mobad should, that he, he, out of, out of them, the whole world has sent money to Baba Mobad, that he should print out his account, he's, he's greedy, and blah, blah, blah. So one day they came up with that Ada Foundation because they want to do, when to do um, something for Justice for Mobad, and they needed funds. So Ada wasn't answering them. They said that Ada is only, is a thief. That she opened foundation. Now we have about two hundred thousand pounds in that whatever, and she's not answering them anymore. Blah blah blah. They rubbish Ada foundation now. These people, these two people here, they rubbish Ada foundation. All right. So they used to go to Ada foundation and uh, uh, YouTube to you know to our show and all stuff like that. But they don't know that behind her, they always mess her up. So. Later, we kept on doing, we were just struggling. We were just struggling because it was myself and uh, Moses and Mr. Miwa that are the member, just others are females. They brought in the lawyer. The lawyer said that he doesn't want to come back to that group again, all because of this set of women. They brought in African TV. African TV came into that group like this. This is a set of women. He ran away. Those, if you go and watch it, you could see African TV tag them as a local set of American women. Go and watch the African woman said so. African TV said it on Yekudi's show. It was it, those are the people that he was referring to. Now, so after that, um, we left the group because due to too much, I guess we came on the um Yekudi's live. Lady the, the Ryan spoke. I have the audios here, you know. So let me see if I can even play the audio for you guys. I have it here. I'll play it for you guys here. Just give me a sec.
You must not over here talk. If you inter How can we be having meeting for four hours and you use three and the other hours to talk rubbish? You know, it got to a point, Mr. Miwa couldn't take it anymore. Mr. Miwa have to leave. And the first person to leave the group was Moses because it was just going, the bashing was just going back and forth and all stuff like that. She's still dealing with that Larry, oh. the Larry that she condemned herself. Eh? The African TV. Who killed Mobad? Yes, I'm yes. I, I believe on who pie Mobad. And for me, I, I, I do not know who pie Mobad. I do not know, but I really want to know. I sincerely want to know if it's a the pie that bought or it is from God that God took him. That's just my own. And we have a closure. The day I get to know, I know I'm going to have a. I'll be glad. The day I know who killed him, and we have a closure when the person that killed him is put away, and we have peace. That would be mission accomplished. You say something? Mission complete, but Okay. Anyway. That's an assumption. <laughs> That's an assumption. That was back then. You could have said that was an assumption because they said that, ah, he stabbed him, he stabbed him, he stabbed him for children. You could have said that that's an assumption. Only thing I'm working for, I'm mm. not working for Baba Baba to be doing his damage control. He damaged, let him go and control himself. Yeah, Baba Mobad's case, I, like I said, he needs to sort out himself with African TV. I don't think we're interested. And so, JP, I remembered you said you were among the people that said he should go to Oriyomi. And then I've asked you. Well, that's you seven uh, weeks ago. Okay, now, now that, now, now that, okay, I understand seven weeks ago, but he's gone now, finally. Now that he's, mm -hmm. the Baba Oriyomi has backed down. Uh, the, uh, the other lady here said she's not going to say anything at all regarding it. You know, as well, somebody has spoken. Uh, um, uh, is it Catherine? Uh, Catherine said she wouldn't say much yet. You know, but um, um, and for one, <coughs> you people have many here, so I don't know who are most useful. But somebody spoke already, pleading Baba. Well, what, what are you? What is your own action? I mean, in your in the group now, what have you people planned? You know. Do you have anything to tell us? With, with regards to what? The to Baba Uri Yomi now, he's backed down. You are aware of it. With regards to Baba Uri Yomi? Yeah. Baba Uri Yomi, I listened to, I just finished. Thanks, one. 
Just let me play on that one. Prime suspect. So we are asking you people, can you please enlighten us? to say boss man and host right i beg make i play this part i beg because this is very important so that it will go with what boss man just played then you can plead listen okay, okay okay let me listen okay thank you very much please listen no? I don't know what's wrong with this thing now. I need him to go and do a passport so that I can get it. So that I can The voice they flung trade to. Passport so that I can get a visa for her. If it's me for her to visit Canada for one or two weeks, you know, uh, that will help her. Who is she using her for? Baba Mobad. No, Baba Mobad don't talk to she. Okay. Listen, you know, without introducing her into the little group we have, about four or five of us then. Was then, you know. Before you know, Catherine came with Bosman. Listen. Catherine was the one that came along with Bosman. Please, Catherine came with Bosman. Catherine came with Bosman. Catherine came along with Bosman. Now my name, I know they shame for me. I love my name. That's why you see the ring. Bosman, this thing you played today, now that the whole world is listening to, I beg, justice for me now. Justice for Ka the same Catherine, the ring whisper here. Justice for me. That was the day I met you. Now lie? Yeah, now. Yeah, the same day. And I came with Susan and Victoria. Victoria, yes. So Yeye Kudi, they, they dragged me to Yeye Kudi's life. They yeah. know you from Adam. Am I lying? Yeah. yeah. So how did I not come with you magically? How did I come with you magically to their group? <laughs> this now woman is a pathetic liar. I beg, on the right, you are giving up to free. know the you are truth. giving up importance. You just want to be famous. That's why I said that I'm go I'm only gonna give her just today to come onto this platform and let us have let me engage you. Williams, come on this. We have two empty space right here. Don't wake up in the middle of the night when women bees are sleeping. It's because only witches that have meeting with the midnight. Okay, when real human beings uh, all over the world are sleeping, that is when you come out to call people out, right? people out, right? And so now we are all awake, right? 
come on it's been over three hours now you have refused your cohort that are on the comment section have refused to drag you up here that thing that you talk to your people because you and the other one you are the smartest of them all all right that's how you can give them fabu okay and that and they actually fall for it so come up here into the box right here and let us talk about it all the nonsense you talk there let us trash it out right now and let us we will go back to not vest not vest I want to drag the Bro, that half clitoris. We go drag her. That half clitoris, where they on yash. Where they make you, they talk it's half way. By the time I give you plastic surgery for that half clitoris, you go talk smart. I mean, you they want to the play. We do it with, with a grammar and with a grammar accent. When I finish for here, I go open platform for you tomorrow. <laughs> I I Nonsense. Are you half clitoris where you take the talk? Where they make you they draw? When I finish with the